That's right. Let's get that word of bill signed into law. So, Senator, you want to make I a comment? I want to make one comment. Uh, there's no one I love more than uh, Senator Mikulski. We're very, very close. We actually have been together on a lot of our Thursday afternoon uh, meetings. And uh, But I have to object to having the senator sit up the dais because we have never done that in the, re in the history of this uh, committee. And I know this came up a couple of times when I was chairman of the committee, and I hope you'll understand that. Uh, Madam Chair, may I respond? Yes. yes. Uh, Madam Chair, you will hear in my testimony that the subcommittee that I have the proud honor to chair, Commerce, Justice, and Science, uh, funds 85% of the science that's done on global warming. I asked to sit at the dais in two capacities. Number one is the senator from Maryland, because this is a hearing, and would, of course, be happy to be joined by my colleague. And I'm delighted that our colleague uh, from the House Senator, uh, Congressman Kilcrest, is here. We do function as Team Maryland uh, in, uh, on the issues related to the state. The second reason uh, that I wanted to sit at the dais, though, is that I do fund 85% of the science uh, that this committee relies upon. All that information that Senator Cardin has uh, uh, conveyed up there and that uh, Senator Inhofe uh, conveys comes from our committee. And I might add the committee's the Mikulski Shelby Committee. We re do function on a keen bipartisan basis. Uh, I will yield to the Senator's uh, objection, but I will ask as a courtesy, since 85% of what we fund, you rely on, I will assume my seat behind you, as I am behind you 100%, and I will function as a staff member to the committee. Let, let me uh, respond. Uh, first of all, uh, if the chairman would agree that this would be a one-time only event, since it hasn't happened before, I would have no objection. Uh, I'd, I'd just make the exception for this meeting. Would you agree well, to that? Well, Senator, Senator, I'm not going to agree to that. I'm the chairman of this committee. I've spoken with you. You knew this was coming. I asked if Senator Mikulski could, could join us. You said that it's not allowed. I went back to the parliamentarian. There is absolutely no rule against this, and many committees do this. I can't tell you from the day one whether this committee has ever done it. I don't think you can either. Indeed, it is permissible. And to, to, it seems to me that we may not agree on this issue. Lord knows we don't. We agree on others. But we should have a sense of comity here. This is a colleague who would bend over backwards for you uh, if you ever asked her for anything. And I am going to ask unanimous consent that we allow Senator Mikulski to join us today. I object, and let me uh, reserve the right to object. What you say is is partially right, but there's never it's unprecedented in this committee. There's not a time I've we've done some research to see if that's ever happened before. It hasn't happened before. We tried it when I was uh, chairman of the committee, and it was objected to. But I'm willing to make the exception for you, Senator Mikulski, and I hope that you will be seated up here and will accept that uh, accept Madam, the invitation. Madam Chair, if I might, as again uh, a personal privilege, but we need to focus on the issue of global warming and the impact on the Bay. We have two outstanding governors here. I want the focus of the hearing to be on the Chesapeake Bay and global warming and not on myself. I yield to the ruling of the chair. Well, the ruling of the chair, if I had a chance to rule, <laughs> would be that you would be joining us. We have had objections. I understand you're trying to move on, and I appreciate it, but I think it's important to take a moment here, and I will do that. This is an outrage. It's an absolute. This is my friend. It's, it's an outrage. I to think. Let me. If I, if, if, I might, an exception? If, if I might. If I might conclude, please. It is an outrage to object to a sincere colleague who wants to work with us on a bipartisan basis on an issue that is so close to her heart. And I and, and, and I am offended. I I. It doesn't diminish my wanting to work with you in the future, but this, I mean, Senator Inhofe was going to go to the floor and object to committee's meeting today if this happened, and he has to leave us, and I would not do something behind his back, so that's why we're having Well, and that's why I'm inviting that. Senator Mikulski to sit up here at the dais and participate. We'll make an exception if you would agree that this is an exception we're making for Senator well, Mikulski. Senator, you'll for, Senator, and I don't see a problem with that. I, Senator, you'll yeah. for a moment. I appreciate your concern that we stick to uh, to, um, to the rules of the House, but 
I, we have a problem in getting senators to attend hearings. It seems to me that it, it, it's helpful if we could have the benefit of another senator in questioning the, the, the really distinguished panel that we have here. And uh, I would just urge you, I understand that you have the right to object and I understand your concern. And I agree with Senator Mikulski, today's hearing is so important, just so important, the subject that we're dealing with. It's, it's not about one senator. It's about the issue of the Chesapeake Bay and the relationship to global warming and the relationship to the other issues that you raised. I just think it would be so helpful this, for this committee to have the expertise of Senator McCarthy. And I agree, Senator Cardin. I agree with everything you just said. So why don't you sit up here and we'll make that an exception for today. Okay, I'm we'll, we'll to make the it. exception today. And I, I am not stating that this will be the only time I will ask for that. But please, Thank you very much, Madam Chair. Right. Thank and you, Senator, Senator McCarthy. Uh, thank you. I, I also... Thank you, then, for the extension of that courtesy. All right. Now, I think we're ready to get started. Now, <laughs> Senator Mikulski, 